Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. John McEnroe was recently in Boston talking to the media about the upcoming 2020 Labor Cup set for September. And while there, he started to make some comments about the state of tennis. In particular, Johnny Mack says he's very disappointed that tennis is not accessible enough to everyone who would like to play. He says affordability and accessibility is a big problem, one that just has not improved that much in the U.S. He says tennis isn't an easy game to learn to begin with, especially in cold climates, because you have to go indoors to play, and that's very expensive. And he says young people just have so many options these days. Think about it, X Games, video games, team sports, and more often they're drawn to the team sports like basketball, football, and baseball. Now think about this, the last American man to raise a Grand Slam singles title was Andy Roddick. That was at the US Open way back in 2003. Max says the Europeans are dominating the men's game. So you don't see a lot of American kids talking about tennis. You don't hear much about tennis on sports news. He says tennis has got to figure out a way to draw kids into the sport. Mack himself and his brother Patrick have been working to grow the game at the John McEnroe Tennis Academy in New York City. He says parents need to know that they don't have to send their kids away to a tennis academy. He believes juniors can stay home and train and still develop world-class skills. Always interesting to hear Johnny Mack's thoughts. So what do you think? How can we grow tennis here in the United States? Now, don't get me wrong, tennis fans love watching great tennis no matter who's playing. And on the women's side, we have had some amazing champs out of the US and a lot to look forward to with all the young players who are coming up. But wouldn't it be great to get back on top on the men's side? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and we'll see you next time.